It began with the forging of the great rings. Three were given to the elves, immortal, wisest, and fairest of all beings. Seven to the dwarf lords, great miners and craftsmen. My rings were gifted to the race of men who above all else desire power. For within these rings was bound the strength and will to govern each race. But they were all of them deceived, for another ring was made. In the land of Morton, in the fires of Mount Doom, the dark Lord Sauron forged in secret a master ring to control all others. And into this ring he poured his cruelty, his malice, and his will to dominate all life. One ring to rule them all. One by one, the free lands of Middle-earth fell to the power of the ring, but there were some who resisted. The last alliance of men and elves marched against the armies of Mordor, and on the slopes of Mount Doom, they fought for the freedom of Middle-earth. Victory was near, but the power of the ring could not be undone. In this moment, when all hope had faded, that Isildur, son of the king, took up his father's sword. Sorrow, the enemy of the free peoples of Middle Earth, was defeated. Library of Rohan, full of knowledge, and I am its keeper. I do know what you carry. How has been your journey so far? Mm. Yes, I know. But you've met kind people along your way, haven't you? <laughs> and you are safe here. You are very welcome to stay a little while, if you wish. Mm. I was... I was reading and sorting some very old papers we've got here. And there are some 
that might be useful for your quest. Let me have a look. Have you heard of this before? This is the story of the rings of power, including yours. I think you should know about this tale, for it is now bound to your own fate. Listen. Now the elves made many rings, but secretly someone made one ring to rule all the others. And their power was bound up with it, to be subject wholly to it, and to last only so long as it too should last. So, so the lived in the land and in the fire, in the, in the land of the shadow. shadow, and while he wore the one ring, he could perceive all the things that were done by means of the lesser rings, and he could see and go the very thoughts of those that were the earths were not so likely to be caught. As soon as Sauron set the one wing upon his finger, they were aware of him, and they knew him and perceived that he would be master of them and of all of the world. Then, in anger and fear, they took off their rings, and they fled from him. Three of their rings he saved, and bore them away, and hid them. But Sauron gathered into his hands all the remaining rings of power. Seven rings he gave to the dwarves, but to men he gave nine. For men proved in this matter as in others already has to do as well. And all those rings that he governed he perverted, and they betrayed in the end all those that used them. The dwarves indeed proved tough and hard. They ill endure the domination of others, and the thoughts of their hearts are hard to fathom, nor can they be turned into shadows. But men proved it to ensnare. To ensnare. Those who used the nine rings became mighty in their day. Kings, sorcerers, and warriors of old. They obtained glory and great wealth, yet they turned to their undoing. And one by one, they defied under the bottom of the rings that they bore, and under the domination of the one. And they became forever invisible, save to Sauron, that wore the ruling ring. And they entered into the realm of shadows. The Nazgul were they, the ring raids, the enemy's most terrible servants. Darkness went with them. And they cried with the voices of death. Mm. You see, you'll have to be very careful, for we humans are not the wisest of all, and might not always be your friends in this quest. But I can see that you've got some strength in you for coming that far. I may have helpful information about Mordor and how to get there by the safest road, even though there is no such thing as a safe way into Mordor. Let me see.
this might help. I will copy some information from these so you'll have the time to read it on the road before the next step of your journey. will give you this map as well so you may find your way through our lands just a human. I've got no magical power of any kind, but I hope this will help, even just a little bit. Now, farewell, ring bearer, and good luck. May the blessings of my people go with you.